This is a story about a geocacher who woke up one Sunday morning and thought that he would go and look for some geocaches on Burke Mountain. It was at this point he knew he effed up. Hey, geocachers, you haven't seen me in a while. I, I understand I've had a bit of a hiatus, but this is a geocaching short video and you're gonna see me try not to die on Burke Mountain. Uh, it's snowing and we're gonna look for some geocaches and hopefully uh, we'll find, hopefully one, but uh, come along and see what we can find. Because I took the bus up, I had to walk up Harper Road and this road goes up to the parking lot, which will take me into the mountain, the uh, Burke Mountain, as they call it. And it's really snowy out here. Typical Canadian weather, at least on the east side of the country. Over here, we usually get rain, and it's a temperate rainforest. But every once in a while, this weird white stuff will fall from the sky, and we wonder, volcanic eruption or snow? Okay, so I ended up crossing a major trail and I am currently walking up a mountain biking trail. Believe it or not, this time of year, I still see mountain bikers come down this trail in the snow. They probably have spiked tires or something. But drying conditions, folks. Like, look at this. The hills are alive with the sound of silence, maybe. I don't know. Uh, we, got, we got a lot of snow and it provides a bit of a sound buffer uh, on the ground. So uh, I'm still walking up to the geocaches, haven't found any yet, but <laughs> you'll be the first to know if I found them. Well, jumping German Jesus. It's snowing all right. To find the cash, or not to find the cash? That is the question. Woo! And it was at this point that Keats94 knew he was crazy. Hey folks, haha, <laughs> well guess what? We found ourselves the, cr the cream of the crop, the one of the best types of geocaches out there. It is a challenge cache. It is in the form of a bison tube and I qualify. So, I mean, what else is there to really say about it? Um, okay, so <laughs> it's right behind me. Oh, 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 look at that. All the way up here. Oh, okay, first cache of the day and it's still snowing and I am crazy because I'm gonna try to find a few more. Um, so. Tag along. Well, folks, you win some and you lose some. In this case, I DNF'd where I go up on Burke. And I have to say, I scoured that slope like no tomorrow. I fell off the slope uh, twice into the creek below. Um, my hands are cold and I thought, you know what, I'm going to call it a day. I'm going to probably revisit that cache in the spring or summertime because right now, as you can see behind me, there's a little bit of snow, just a tad, and uh, this stuff is going to be here for definitely a few months. So that's okay. You win some, you lose some, and I will be back with full force and uh, be determined to... Uh, complete that that where I go and sign the logbook well folks so concludes another short video of uh, Keats 94's geocaching adventures uh, we uh, we did end up finding a cache today uh, it was one so it was you know one and done nice and special DNF to where I go but uh, we'll be back for that uh, my face is really frozen right now so if I sound kind of drunk that's why um, we're on green earth now, uh, up behind us, we got a bit more snow. It's amazing the, the difference between this side of the road and that side of the road in terms of snow. 
Anyway, thank you so much for watching. And if you like this short episode, uh, like and subscribe. You know, um, I'm going to keep trying to post videos, but uh, yes, you've probably seen a bit of a hiatus with my channel. Apologize for that. I really want to uh, get that up and running again more. But unfortunately, uh, you know, life gets in the way and um, I want to make this channel uh, better and I'm trying to strategize on how to make that happen. So thank you for being patient with me and tagging along with me on these adventures. Uh, Burke Mountain is a fantastic place full of awesome geocaches. And um, so thank you so much for coming along and uh, stay tuned, more geocaching adventures to come.